Central Michigan University, a, a math degree uh, from Northeast University of Boston. And I joined the Air Force in the heart of the Vietnam War in, uh, in 1967 uh, to serve my country uh, when I knew they were calling me. 27 years in the Air Force, had a wonderful career. I was a computer guy for about four years, so I understand computers. I was a programmer, operator, and I ran computer shops. Uh, I was a pilot, instructor pilot. I was a commander, flight commander, aircraft commander, and I was a group commander when I retired. I had five diverse squadrons under my command at the time, a contracting squadron, aircraft maintenance squadron, supply squadron, transportation squadron. And uh, I did a lot of exercise plans. I was a logistics planner for a long time. I used to plan multi-continent, multi-service, multi-nation nation exercises. Training, preparing people and equipment, deploying it, executing a mission, bringing it back home, hot washing it, preparing for the next one. I spent six years city commissioner of Plant City, a nonpartisan seat, citywide. I understand what it's like to be a nonpartisan, making sure that you're taking care of everyone at all times. And this seat is probably the most nonpartisan seat there is. Um, in the citywide elections in Plant City, they were citywide, so you serve everybody in the community, not just one portion. That's what we have to do in the supervisor's office. Uh, as a state representative, I passed laws helping my foster kids make the transition out of foster care to adult life. I promised those young kids after my first year I would pass a bill for them. I only had six bills a year, and I gave them one every year, and I filed eight bills to help our foster kids make that transition. I passed bills creating a circle of safety around our kids from sexual predators, protecting the kids rather than the places. And I passed a grandparents bill to help grandparents raising grandchildren to make sure that they have the authority they need to take care of those kids while their parents are not in our absence. Uh, I'm running for supervisor of elections because having spent 27 years of my life defending our country and our constitution, which I always carry a copy with me right here. Our whole government starts at the supervisor's office. It starts at that ballot box. And I believe that everyone who is a US citizen, who is eligible to register the vote, should be registered to vote. And I believe that every person who wants to vote should have an easy and convenient way to vote to cast their ballot to ensure that no vote is not counted, to ensure that no one who's not eligible to vote votes. That's the most precious thing we have in our country. I'll be glad to answer questions later on, and I'll summarize later on. But right now, uh, Rich Glorioso, VoteGlorioso.com. Appreciate your support. Looking forward to the questions.